ClickUp 3.0 has arrived and it's now out in the wild. And in today's video, we're going to be doing an overview of what's new with ClickUp 3.0. This has been sponsored by ClickUp and is a tutorial of the latest features that ClickUp are releasing as part of our partner news series. So thanks to ClickUp for sponsoring and let's dive into some of those features. The first of those is Home. It's getting much more tailored to streamline your workflow with new recent cards, Lineup, which is a place to prioritize your day, Agenda, which allows you to see your daily events and switch between the calendar to rearrange your task due dates, assigned to me, reminders, and assigned comments, which all consolidate the most important information across your workspace so that you can see it at a glance. Now, task view has been much more refined, allowing you to get a redesigned cover image, as well as expandable sections for full screen optimization. You can also collapse subtasks in the sidebar, which means it's great for quick navigation through an entire subtask tree for your large tasks and great for task creation and deletion of functionality. Now, ClickUp Inbox has also been redefined as well, which is much more email-like to help streamline communication and collaboration with team members. So there's a dedicated tab called Important, and you can see all of your notifications with a brand new snoozing function and even marking as unread. You can customize your inbox as well by grouping by date for easier digesting, and there's notifications to get the most important context. And underpinning all of this, you can use hotkeys and keyboard navigation to go through your inbox much faster. You can clear per tab and filter, which means that you can get to the point by clearing in bulk, and also you can use notifications where they can be bundled by task, page, chat, and much more, which means you can plow through your inbox much faster in ClickUp. Universal Search is coming to ClickUp as well, allowing you to leverage the power of ClickUp Search across multiple different accounts outside of ClickUp. So you can bring in Google Drive, Box, Confluence, Dropbox, Figma, and you can even create new Figma and Google files just from ClickUp without even having to go to the other application. And it's also getting better the more time you use it by personalizing it and also bringing the search results to be much more relevant as you use it and on the go. Now, when it comes to AI, ClickUp want to do a few things. The first of those is stand-ups. This is instantly generate activity summary for teams, which are great for stand-up meetings, and also thread summaries, which summarize comments in the threads for quicker insights. Task summaries allow you to have uh, obviously tasks that have been defined with specific time frames and also tools that can be plugged into content, especially the documents experience, to help you write with AI, which is perfect generative writing assistant to help summarize, improve, expand on writing that you're already doing, as well as a subtask generator to create top subtasks based on the parent tasks context. There's also a new items hubs area, which allow you to centralize your documents, whiteboards and dashboards in one location. This is perfect for accessing your most recently viewed stuff, favorited stuff and personally created items. And you can utilize the list view to efficiently sort the filter, your documents, whiteboards and dashboards as they get potentially out of hand as you add lots more of them. And finally, Location Overview is a bird's eye view and structure of all of the spaces and folders, which means you can manage your lists, projects with the portfolio widget and attach files and resources to your spaces and folders, allowing you to view and find your documents much more easy. Now you can make it easier for new users to understand how spaces and folders are structured at a glance. So ClickUp are really redefining elements of their experience, and this is in particular noticeable in the task view area. You can really see some much better upgrades when it comes to the redesigned comments area, performance improvements, and customizable custom fields area, as well as a whole host of improvements with task relationship, subtasks, relationships, and also attachments as well. So that's everything around the new ClickUp 3.0. You can read the full release in the description below, but thanks to ClickUp for coming on and diving into the sponsored part of this news story to give you an insight into what they have released. So thank you very much to ClickUp and I'll speak to you all for soon and I hope you enjoy uh, using ClickUp 3.